Why is it sound like a little cough? <coughs> what is going on guys? My name is Felix and welcome to the video. Today I'm going to run through my weekly outfit diary for this week. That is from the 12th of February to the 16th of February. 12, 13. That's five days. I'm going to leave links to the products down in the description below. If you do want to buy any of the items you see me wearing in this video, please use the links down below because it really does help me out. Even just clicking on the link really does help me and just means I can make better content in the next few weeks and progress week by week. On Monday, I tried to go for a very monotone fit, much like the rest of the week actually, because the weather's kind of a bit iffy at the moment so I felt like my outfit would match the weather. So on feet I had a pair of Raph Simmons Stan Smiths, the black and white monochrome uh, edition. These came out for Fall Winter 17, they're in my shoe collection. They're really really comfy as long as you break them in. For trousers I'm just wearing a pair of Dickies 872s, they're just easy to wear. I wish I had an 8 pair of 873s just because they're a little bit wider because I feel like 872s are a slight bit too slim for me at the moment and I want a little bit of a wider silhouette. On top I've got a JW Anderson Uniqlo collaboration t-shirt, really really nice, I think it's sold out but I got it for on sale while I was in Paris in Uniqlo. It's a really really nice t-shirt. I bought the black one as well as the blue one and it was a really really good like deal. I think I got both of them for 15 euros. And then for jacket I've just got my Urban Outfitters puffer jacket. Quite simple basic puffer jacket. It just fits really nicely as well and I love it. I've got a bit of jewellery on as well. I've got a Opus Chains necklace as well as a two ASOS rings as well as an Opus Chains bracelet which I always have on. I never ever take this off just because it's easy and you'll see this is a recurring thing in every single fit. I was in uni most of the day so it was more of a comfy outfit, just something simple just like a chuck on and go to uni and be comfortable wearing. You'll notice this week I don't really wear a lot of logos and stuff because I do work at a store where I can't wear logos. I do kind of incorporate my outfits into the less logo type of stuff. You'll see which days I'm working clearly because I'm not wearing heavy graphic t-shirts. Next up for Tuesday I really wanted a very baggy silhouette. I really wanted to wear my salad trousers so I thought yes let's, let, let's bring that in. Let's wear those 100%. I was going to work that evening and I really wanted to wear them to work because they're so comfy. So on feet we've got a pair of Air Force Ones. Just a pair that I bought for eBay onto for 20 quid, but I'll link down in the description a couple of colorways, as well as the latest colorway that's gonna come out soon, with the removable swooshes, which I really, really want, and I'm actually doing a proxy for a pair next week, so I'll do an unboxing for those. Obviously, on my trousers, I've got a pair of the Salad trousers from weekday. So comfy, they look so great with a pair of Air Force Ones. Probably my favorite trousers at the moment, 100%. And then on top, we've just got a plain weekday Big Hawk hoodie in the gray colorway, and underneath that, I've just got my ASAP Rocky Redding t-shirt, which I got from Reading in 2016. Wow, that was a long time ago. Again, I'm wearing the same jewellery that I was wearing the day before. So for Wednesday, it was Valentine's Day and I thought I'd make my ma my outfit match that. I pulled up my pink Stussy 8-ball t-shirt that I got in the New York store. I haven't seen that colorway anywhere else apart from the New York store, so I assume it's a limited colorway for that, for either for the US or for that store alone. On feet, I'm wearing a pair of Vans DSM Skate Highs. Really comfy Vans vault, so they're gonna they can really really good. Just for walking around all day, it was really really great. For bottoms, I got a pair of Levi's 501s. I actually had them draped over the shoe, and I didn't really like how this looks in this video, but I changed it and rolled it up so that the puff just kind of sat on the top of the uh, uh, skate high. And then of course on top, I've got my Stussy 8 ball T-shirt. It kind of fits really really comfy. It's probably one of my favourite like T-shirts fit wise because it just it, everything fits perfectly the way I wanted to in every like single area. Not in this video, but I actually wore my Carhartt Nimbus pullover just again trying to keep it comfy very warm because it was raining that day and chucking it down as for Thursday I was at work again so I thought I'd spice it up a little bit with this outfit so on feet I've got a pair of nine, uh, Air Max 97 silver bullets that from the April release last year love them very very comfy I've beaten them a little bit as well so they look like they've been worn in for a long time and I just love that look they look so good at the moment for bottoms I've got a pair of Zara pinstripe trousers that I actually got like two years ago again for the t-shirt underneath, I was just wearing my Ejda That One Time t-shirt that released, I think, when they first opened the store. And on top, again, I'm wearing my weekday grey Big Hawk hoodie. Again, to work because it's just comfy, baggy, and it's just really easy to style, and it matches perfectly with the Air Max 97s. I also have my Eastpac backpack on because I was going to work, so I thought it was kind of cool just to have the backpack in there. And finally for today, which is Friday, I've been wearing my Nike Blazer GT anthracite. I've got a pair of Billionaire Boys Club socks because, I don't know, the path, they're like patterned all over so they kind of contrast with it because it's such a black outfit. I really wanted to have something that kind of breaks it apart 
and that was the socks, especially having black jeans and black shoes. Again, on for bottoms, I've got my pair of Levi's 501s. On top, I've got my FA MLK t-shirt, which I actually bought from Supreme New York. For over the top of that, I had my Urban Outfitters like teddy jacket. Again, I'm just trying to be extra comfy today because it is the last day of the week and I'm going into uni for like two hours. So I thought, let's just be really, really comfortable. And then on top, I've got the Vans Salton 2 cap. This just fits beautifully. I love the fit of it. Um, I got my girlfriend got me this for Valentine's Day. We were just in the van store and I just saw it and it was on sale and I was like, I really want that. And she was like, do you want it for Valentine's Day? Because we're not doing very big presents this year at all because it's her birthday next week. And then we've been together for two years the week after that. But this is a great fitting cap. She actually got me this pin on the side. It's the heart pin. She got it on eBay. It looks like it's got a night tick on it, but I don't know. I think it might just be the glint from it, but it looks really cool. But it just fits really nicely, and I just love the colour and the shape of it. It's not just about big brands, especially for hats. I just think just find a hat that fits you, and if it fits nicely, just wear it. But anyway, guys, that has been my outfit diaries for this week. If you see anything that you wanted, I'll link it down in the description below if I can find it. All alternatives if they're no longer available. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next video. I'm going to try and maintain a Wednesday, Sunday sort of rotor for my videos. Of course, it was different for this week because the Supreme Preview came out on the Monday and I just wanted to get that video out ASAP. But from next week, it will continue on the Wednesday-Sunday scheme because it just works really well for me and it just means I can evenly record videos and edit them in time. So I'll see you guys in the next video. See you later.